did you know did you know that there are three sums that are found in a bill of quantity yani lump sums that are inserted in a bill of quantity for various reasons today we shall be looking at the three types of sums that you find in a bill of quantity the first sum is usually called the prime cost sum the prime cost sum is the sum of money that is inserted in the bill of quantity as an allowance for the nominated subcontractor the nominated subcontractor is that subcontractor who is appointed by the client through the architect to do some specialist job in the site so if he quotes a sum of like 2 million we shall come and insert it in the bill of quantity as pc sum 2 million for the nominated contract subcontractor but still because he will work under the main contractor on the site the main contractor should be provided for a percentage as profit on the pc sum so the pc sum generally is that money to be paid to the nominated subcontractor which whereby he provides the quotation and the quotation shall be used to pay him then a certain percentage shall be provided for the main contractor because he's the one who is in charge of the site all the overheads are on the main contractor still the main contractor should receive some percentage as profit the second sum that is usually in a bill of quantity is the provisional sum provisional sum is the sum of money that is usually in the bq for jobs that we cannot be able to know their extent clearly when we are doing tender you know when we are tendering we use the drawings the specifications these documents cannot give us enough details to tell us the extent of certain works on the site for example dewatering we shall dewater the trenches what is the extent of the water in the trenches that one can only be determined on the site another example is a site may look clean but deep inside we have large limestone rocks which can cause a lot of cost overruns so because we can only determine the extent of this work when we get to site we provide a provisional sum provisional meaning in the meantime we quote this much you know it can change once we receive enough details the third sum in the bill of quantity is called the contingency sum have you ever been in your budget written miscellaneous you know it's those things that may crop up that you had not anticipated we usually provide two to five percent for this money that we, we had not anticipated issues that may come up then we also provide 10 to 15 percent for the alterations that can be done by the architect for example an architect may want to change the drawings so he will use this 10 to 15 percent that we provide as contingency without going back to the client to ask for extra cash so this money is used only when the architect approved approves that it can be used so those are the three sums of money that are usually found in a bill of quantity if you like this content please subscribe give this video a thumbs up and continue to give to our channel thanks for watching